Hey guys, Keith here from Keith Tech Tips. The internet is an amazing place to discover new content. In this video, I'm going to share 13 of the most interesting websites that you definitely should know about. Some of these are for entertainment purposes only, while some could be useful to you. Let's get to it. Type and feel like a hacker on your computer from this website. Open this website and press random keys on your keyboard. What gets typed is basically some scripts or codes that have been pre-fed into this website. You want to see something awesome? Hold down the ALT key once done playing around. This website is a disposable email service to counter spam emails. This temporary email service generates an email address for you and lasts for 10 minutes. But you do have an option to increase the time by 10 minutes again. Use this service instead of giving out your real email address in sites where you must sign up for some information but never use again. The emails will arrive in this inbox here and if you want to use a different email, just change it here. Virus Total This website lets you upload any file and will scan it for you. This is awesome to use when you come across a file that is suspicious or just want to check how it works. Not only files, but also websites that you want to double check. Just post the URL of the website here and you'll get to know if the website is clean and safe to browse. The two tabs I use the most are file and URL. To check a file on the computer, select choose file. Once you've selected it, click on open. At the top, that is the response you want. To scan a URL, just paste it in the search box. If you get a result not similar to this, it might be best to avoid that website. This is another important one called Have I Been Owned? We often hear about websites that have been compromised and passwords being leaked. But how are you supposed to know if your data has been leaked? Well, that's the point of this site. Type in your email address and it'll tell you if your email address or any other potential info was included in any breaches in recent times. That way, you'll know not only to change your password on that site, but also not to use that same password again. Moving on, down for everyone or just me. This one is great and so simple. It tells you any website that you type in is up or down. I'm sure this has happened to you many times. You try to go to a website and it either takes forever to load or won't load at all and you're wondering if the problem is on your end or not. And there's nothing more than that. If the website is down, it'll tell you that it's not just you. Pixabay. This is an awesome stock photo website and every single picture is royalty free. They are released under the Creative Commons Zero License, which means that they are released into the public domain. There are over a million photos and it's not more than those available on paid sites that are out there. But hey, can't complain, it is free. There are high quality images here that you can use. From desktop wallpapers to being used in your videos. Moving on, Alternative 2. Now this is a fantastic service which helps you find alternatives for desktop computer software, web-based software and mobile applications. For example, let's choose Adobe Premiere Pro. You will see a description of this program and below that you will see the top alternatives to Premiere Pro. It will give you a brief description, reviews and the operating system that the program supports. The next one is Khan Academy. It was founded in 2006 and is perhaps one of the best educational websites. At Khan Academy, there are several categories including math, computing, science and many others. In addition to the various courses listed, they even offer test prep and college entrance exams. This is for those of you who suspect online reviews. And with all the fake reviews online, who wouldn't be? It filters product reviews from various websites including Amazon, Walmart, TripAdvisor and a few others. It analyzes suspicious patterns and reviews to find out what is said about the products you want to buy. Here's how it works. Copy the URL, go back to the fake spot website, paste the URL 
and select Analyze Reviews. Based on the authenticity of the existing reviews, it'll give the product review a review grade from A to F. In the Overview section, you can get more details. This information is useful when you want to get a non-biased review of the product. Solo Learn This is a top recommendation for beginners who want to learn the absolute basics of programming. In addition to their website, you can also learn on the go with their Android and iOS apps. Unlike similar websites, Solo Learn is completely free with tutorials for Python, JavaScript, Ruby, HTML, CSS, and many others. Once you select a course, just follow the instructions and learn at your own pace. Now, if you're like me and prefer to do your repairs yourself, iFixit is a website you should bookmark. In addition to selling tools and parts, they also have free repair guides for many of today's popular electronic devices, along with those long forgotten. There are more than a dozen categories to choose from, including PC, DSLRs, Mac, phone, and many others. After you've found your repair guide, it'll show you the difficulty level, how many steps are involved, the time required, along with the tools needed to complete the job. Below that, you just have to complete the easy to follow step-by-step -step directions in order. Now, when setting up a new Windows PC, Ninite is an awesome package manager that lets you install multiple programs all at once without any extra junk, like toolbars. Here's how it works. Select the programs listed that you'd like to install that they have available. I'll go with Firefox, 7-Zip, Zoom, Evernote, VLC, Audacity, Net 4.8, Blender, Dropbox, Malwarebytes, Notepad++, and Terracopy in Utilities. Now, when you're done making your selection, click on Get Your Nanite. Over here, this is what happens after you click on Get Your Nanite. Wolfram Alpha. This is a computational knowledge engine that answers factual queries by computing the answers from externally sourced curated data. In other words, the founder refers to it as a fact search engine. Instead of pointing you to other web pages, just like typical search engines, it returns answers instead. If you have any more interesting websites, let me know in the comments below, and I'll see you in the next one.